disgusting. Good morning, you dirty stash bags. It is early. Just kidding. It's 8.30. It's not that early. But I just woke up. And uh, I'm going to go right back to that creek where I was at in the last video. I'm going to try to catch some big fish. That's all, that's all we're going to do. That's all we're trying to do. And uh, I don't know. We'll take anything we can get. And you never know what you're going to get at dirty old creeks as we've found out from previous exploration videos. So I'm going to go back and explore that creek a little bit more. I didn't have that much time last time, so we'll see what we can catch. There's some pretty big fish, and uh, I'm going to try to catch some. See where the day takes us and stuff. Let's go! you got creeks in your area, you should really go down and try them. Especially spillways and waterfalls like this, because you never know what you're going to catch, and it's just it's just different. It's just more exciting, more fun in my opinion. I always get stuck on the bass fishing in the early spring because they're just so fat and so angry, but yeah, we're gonna keep creek fishing for at least another week or two and then see what else we can come up with. I can see them down here. I can see you. Yep. 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 Nope. We're grinding on rocks. This weightless worm thing is actually pretty fun. If you see carp swimming around with their mouth at the top of the water, they won't bite your <clears throat> jig head or your bottom cart corn rig. Tie on something weightless, throw it in the current and hold on tight. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's a larger one. <laughs> He's going downstream. I don't know if this will ever get old. I don't know how big it is. Last time I was here, I saw some that were 20 pounds. I don't think this one's 20 pounds, but it's definitely larger. Yep, 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 yep. Come here, you freshwater boner fish. Come here, bud. Come here, little Timmy. I know, I know. I'm a dickhead, I poked you in the face. But at least I'm gonna <gasps> I was saying, at least I'm gonna let you go. I don't know now, I might have to kill you after that. After that stunt. I'm just kidding, I won't kill you. I mean, this is a little creek. It's like a five pound fish. Here you go, little bud. Get out of here. <clears throat> Bye. Bye, Timmy. Bye, carp, Timmy. Uh. I caught two carp. Yeah. Yeah. Did it bother you guys start to go and got a bow and start shooting them? No, shoot the shit out of them. You ever do that? No, I probably would shoot my foot instead of the fish or something. Oh, that's kind of fun. I've never even seen anybody do it, so yeah, I'm. Doesn't bother me. I actually wish you would. I want to see it. You gonna be here a while? Yeah, I got like three hours. I'm gonna run home. I've got two bows. I'm a lefty, but I've also got a righty. Both of them. Do you want to give it a try? I'd do I, it. If you're going to be here, I'll grab both bows and I'll let you give it a try. It's fun. I'm down. <laughs> All right, man. I might break your arrows. I don't give a shit. I got a bunch of Deal. I might try to shoot a carp today. Even though it's against my uh, kind-hearted, carp-loving nature, there's obviously plenty of them. And I've always wanted to try it. So I think we're going to try it. All right. A little midday update. Got a carp. And, uh, yeah. About it. Met a local community man. I didn't get his name yet. We'll ask his name later. That uh, said, he's gonna go get his bows. He's got two bows. I've never tried bow fishing, so should be pretty sweet. I'm not guaranteeing I'll hit anything, but just certainly gonna try. So when he gets back, that's what we're gonna do. So see you then. Met my buddy Jim. That's the good thing about fishing uh, inner city shithole creeks and shit like that because uh, you run into people. And I've always wanted to bow fish, and Jim gracefully. Gracefully? Graciously? What word am I looking for? 
in good. English and shit. We're gonna go out and see if we can't shoot a carp. Don't expect much out of this. Uh, I imagine he's gonna hit a bunch of fish, and I imagine I'm gonna miss a bunch of fish, but it's worth a shot, let's do it. As long as I don't lose my shoes, well, actually, I don't even care if I lose my shoes. <laughs> I was hoping there'd be some fish in here. That'd be easy. It happens quite a bit. I bet. Like oh, yeah. Typically what I'll do is I'll just walk along until I start to see their shadows, but uh, I don't know. If we get too close to water, we tend to spook them. They just feel the vibration. Mm -hmm. You so got walk. polarized, oh, you got polarized glass. I got bifocals. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so when you're shooting that fish, shoot, shoot low. Shoot low. Yeah. There's a bird, we can shoot the bird. Good luck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Even harder. They're there. Yeah, we'll have to just walk, kind of, if you can get kind of in a shadowy spot, um, just better. walk nice and light footed. I'm gonna tie my shoe before I eat shit. It looked like there was two or three right there. Yeah. It didn't look like one fish. So what's this called, a recurve bow and that's a compound bow? Look, look at me go. Look at you. I'm an Got expert. It. Well, usually if there's one, there's more. Yeah. Rip his hat off, sea bass. Did you get him? Nope, right in front of him. I, I saw his like swirl though. Yeah. I mean, that's a, at least we saw some. Oh, there's more. Yeah, we're gonna see more. <laughs> But I mean, just walking right down here, right away, seeing some. Yeah, that's a good sign. I actually saw that one without the sunglasses. <laughs> see his back? He's just laying there. Just, yeah, I'm going to stay up here so I don't spook him. That's a big buffalo, too. Is it? I actually saw one. Hold that car. Oh, fail. <laughs> what happened there? Am I just a failure? I think your, your reel was locked. Is he still there? Yeah, he's moving out. That's a big grass car. Since you love grass carp, do you want to shoot him? No, I want to see you get him. All right. Go ahead and get right down to the edge. Can you still see him? Kind of. It's hard. He's diving. It's hard. Quick. He'll come up and eat on this grass here, probably. Here he comes. Can you get closer? He's going to be hard to hit. It's just hard without the polarized glasses. Go for it if you see him. I'll shoot with you. I don't even see him anymore without the sunglasses. He's right under that grass mat. He's come up here on the grass. Head. Shoot him. Headed. Yep. I lost him. I think he's still under it. Make sure your button's pushed. Yeah, he's still there. Ready? Count of three. Count it off. One, two, three. You got him. Did I get him? Yep. Are you sure? Yep. No way. <laughs> He'll pull right off. Oh, I think he did. Oh. Nice I shot. I hit him. You got him. I saw your arrow sticking out of his side. So what should I have done differently? Just Nothing. hand reel it? No. Well, yeah, I probably let him take a little bit line. Just the weight a little bit. Because their scales are so thick, you that. barely got under the skin. Gotcha. That's why I was just going to tell you, uh, grass carp pull off real easy. Well, I think we found the spot, though. Yep. That's I think I got a scale on it. That was a big grass carp. You did. Yep. Big ass scale. <laughs> See that thing? There you go. There's your trophy scale. So it just didn't. He barely yeah. even felt that. I'll bet. Look at that. Yeah. Barbs so didn't, didn't go through. So what? I just didn't pull back hard enough. Probably. Yeah, he's out there a little ways for that bow. But yeah, yeah you got him. I saw the arrow zoom out. Well, you felt him pull, didn't you? Yeah, well, yeah, my line <laughs> shot. <laughs> like, I was like, oh shit. That is a large scale. And what do you think? It was like ten pounder, fifteen. Oh yeah, that was at least a ten pounder. Probably even a little bigger. I'm gonna keep that. That's yeah. my. That's my <laughs> first, first scale. First, first shot, man. That was awesome. Maybe I maybe I can do this. I don't know. You can do this. Shit, I missed him. I shot under him. I just sprayed and prayed and happened to hit him. Yeah, <laughs> it was perfect. Dead center uh, side uh, of his side, body, was side. it? Honestly, if my arrow didn't fall out that first time. Yeah, you were closer to him the first time. Yeah, I might have been able to get him. Well, I guess I got him. I just yeah, didn't. Did. I just didn't get him. That's get him. Missed. I think we found him, bud. Right there, you see him moving the grass. Left side of that bigger. Yeah, right up. Uh, left side of the dead tree there. See him moving around out there? Oh yeah, I see him. I mean, if you don't mind getting muddy, go no. for it. Another one over there. Yep. They don't look large though, do they? Can't really tell yet. The one over here, yep, that's a big one. See his whole head's out of the water. One just moved the weeds over there too. Yep. Oh, I saw his, saw his fin stick out. I think he's the other direction now. If you can get another five yards, he'll be within bow range. There's another one over here. You another one over there? Oh yeah, yeah. oh yeah, take that one. Wait till he turns broadside. There you go. Uh, I think it was low. I saw your arrow flip up, but I think it 
Yeah, under his belly. I was somewhat close. Yeah, you were. <laughs> Seems like there's a lot more fish over here, just not as big. Oh, I just saw a bigger one. Did you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Got him. I think. I think. Oh, no, I shot low. Shit. I thought I... Oh, I saw him turn right in front of you. Yeah, he's... He took off. I thought I hit him for sure. I had the... sounded like a hit. I had the... I saw his whole side. He just... There he is. Oh, there's two of them. I'm going to catch this one with my hands. Oh, God, there's so many of them. Do I duck? Yeah. He's right by my arrow. He, oh, no. he just swam over my arrow. This is so cool just because it's so shallow. Uh-huh. Even in the shallow water, they can slide right through without even being detected. Oh, yeah. They're crafty little bastards. Oh. Let's wait. Aim lower. There you go. Lower. Nice shot. Did right I get him? In. Oh, you bounced it right off his head. I Did can I? see the mark where you hit him, too. Oh, God. <laughs> I thought I got... Yeah, you hit him right in the head. Did I just not pull back far? Probably. Yeah, you hit him right in that, that real the bony hard part. plate. Yeah, that was, a, that was a silver. That was? Yeah, that was a silver. Oh, there he goes. Yep. Little dickhead. He's freaking out now. He doesn't know where to go. <laughs> He's <laughs> he just right. the crowd. I need is to... Is he going to come back out here? Probably. This is badass, man. I've never done anything like this. I know. I've already been freaking out, and I haven't even... I've hit two, but... Yeah, that one, I, I missed him, but I was, still could see the mark on the side of his head where you hit him. So what do you do with them? Because people are going to ask. So how do you turn them into fertilizer? Blend them? Um, the grass carp will smoke. But commons um, and you can just, silvers? Yeah, I, actually for the the commons and stuff, I don't I don't know. I don't do a whole lot of smoke with those or anything. I usually just bury those in the garden. Yeah, make some healthier yeah. flowers. Oh, yeah. That's some of the best fertilizer, I think. I just need to pop my cherry. Yeah. I got blue balls right now from hitting that one and getting the scale. <laughs> the <two balls. laughs> yeah. Knock that one in the head, knock the other one in the back. Yeah, there's a couple of them. Can you get on this log comfortably? Yeah, I just don't know. Oh, yeah, it's, it's wobbly for sure. Oh, God. Yeah, you should be. It's... Here, let me, uh, I'm going to get to the other side and then <clears throat> it's not very wobbly over here. It's just right when you get on down there. There's, there's some up here too. I got two. Oh, I missed him. I missed him again. That was a, that was a bigger gar. Now he's looking at me. The back of my arrow is stuck into a log. I'm gonna try. That was sketchy. Ah, oh, damn it. My tip's gone. Yeah, I don't know how long ago. Maybe before the gar. What do we do now? Are you sure? Nice God. Oh, he buried it too. Don't let him wrap. Don't let him wrap. No, up. sorry, sorry. <laughs> we won't get him out of there if he wraps up. There you go. There it is. Nice shot. Thanks, dude. I got him. Smoked him. Never. He's not going oh, anywhere. oh God. That's disgusting. He's like projectile bleeding. I hit him and I panicked. That's a hell of a good shot. That's perfect, man. All right. Well, how many years did it take, Jimmy? <laughs> Actually, it only took you about four sh good shots yeah, before you true. got one to stay on. I don't think that guy's living, so what's he, he's going to turn into 
fertilizer, I guess. Yeah, we'll make him into some garden food. Bury him in the garden, make some nice tomatoes for Jim's family. And uh, there's a shitload of them back here anyway, so. Oh well, you guys know that I like carp, like fishing for carp, but there's definitely an abundance of them and some of them need to die. And I think this one's on the verge. Or is he already dead? He's not gonna make it too much longer. <laughs> he was like, there's like blood flying out. All right, well, I like carp and I don't like killing him, but this one's dead, so. But yeah, I did it. I shot. Thanks, bud. Now what? Reload. Not through all the way. Just take it and shoot. Put your foot on it. it. Through. No, you don't even need to do that. Push it through, and then just un loosen the tip, and you'll see the barbers can flip back the other way. Then, and then you can dump them right off. And then you just yep, slide them right off. Add him to the pile. Add him to the pile of carp. That one's that one's fertilizer. The grass carp that he's smoking is back over yonder. We're gonna have to go get that thing, but I did it. Never give up. Nice all, shot. Th all thanks to Jimmy. Nice shot, man. Gar. Hit your button. Got him! Oh, <laughs> Jeez, man! <laughs> that thing is tiny! <laughs> I got him good, too. Like, yeah, he's... He, did. he didn't flinch. He's done. I actually want one about this size for my, uh... I'm getting an aquarium, but I don't think he's gonna live in an aquarium. <laughs> You might not want to shoot him there if you want him for your aquarium. Yeah, I'm gonna to have to try to catch Look one in the mouth. Tiny he is. There you go. You got it. You got to figure it figured out. I think I'm. I think I'm dialed, kinda. I think you're ready to get your own bow and keep going. Yeah. Let me hold this dirty thing. Yep. Don't let them. Uh, if they start flexing those scales too much. I know they're they sharp. Yeah. All right. Well, we're gonna add him to the fertilizer pile. Right back here. You're not gonna. You're not gonna smoke this one, are you? <laughs> no, not that guy. People do eat gar. If he was a like a big alligator gar or something, I'd give him a try. Yeah. Even a big, you know, much bigger gar, I would try it. But yeah. He's kind of small. I'm uh, not gonna get too much out. Of yeah, he's. Twitching. He's gonna go on our fertilizer pile. There you go. Fertilizer. Was that whopping three steps before you saw that one? <laughs> yeah, that didn't take long. I went from nothing to two in a hurry. Spot and good shooting. Yeah, that wasn't too bad for a for a damn rookie. I couldn't even see him. Uh, the grass is in the way from where I was standing. I couldn't see him. Yeah, I was. I walked almost right up on him before I saw him, and he didn't move. So, awesome. Done did it. All right, I am tired, but that yawn was forced. Bow fishing is it. It can wear you out. We were uh, up in the flooded water, just walking around, slopping around, and my nike prestos that uh are pretty much ruined now but that's okay they weren't very clean to start with i don't know how i've ever how i've never tried bow fishing um i just thought i'd never be able to hit anything and i actually jim could be lying to me but he said i actually ended up being pretty decent my first shot i actually hit a pretty big grass carp it was probably like 15 pounds or something maybe 20 and uh, i just didn't pull it back hard enough or something because it didn't stay in there but i don't know that's like i've only shot like two other things in my life and they're birds and yeah I've never really been into hunting I've never really shot and killed anything and uh, huge shout out to Jim crazy how stuff like that happens and you just randomly run into people when you're fishing at public lakes public streams creeks and stuff like that because just sitting there talking he offered to take me bow fishing and we went bow fishing and it was actually pretty badass but yeah if you want to see more bow fishing comment down below leave a thumbs up and uh, subscribe. It's something I definitely want to try again. I don't know if I'm going to get real into it, like buy my own bow or something, but let me know what you guys think and maybe I'll do some more. I think I covered everything. Rambling for too long. Talk to you guys. Talk to you guys real soon. Goodbye. Okay,